Hi everyone, welcome back to 365 Ninja. Today's tip is about taking screenshots with OneNote 2013. So you might want to put a screenshot in your OneNote page and you can certainly use whatever screen clipping capability that you'd like, but OneNote 2013 actually has that capability integrated right into it. So the first way that I'll show you is using the send to OneNote feature. Now this little window may pop up with your OneNote 2013 when you first open it, if you have this box checked. If you want to retrieve it, you can also press the Windows key plus N, or you can just navigate it to it in your list of programs. It's called Send to OneNote. So the thing you'll need to remember with this is that you actually want to have what you'd like to take the screenshot of up before you click the button. So let's say that I want to take a, a screenshot of my admin center here. I will make that my active window, then go to send to OneNote, click screen clipping, and you can see that my window was sort of grayed out, and now I can choose exactly what I want. Once I do that, I have to pick a section where to put the copied screen clipping it's not going to automatically insert it into whatever OneNote page you have open, which can maybe slow you down, but it also can be really helpful. So if I just want to put it in my current section, I'll click that, send to selected location. I can also copy it to my clipboard and do whatever I want. So now when I go to my OneNote page, there's my screenshot. And you can see that it actually inserted the URL that I was on and the time and date that I took that screen clipping, which can be really helpful if you're taking notes and you want to remember exactly where and when you were when you took the screenshot. So the second method is to actually just have your OneNote page open where you want to insert the screenshot, go to your Insert tab, and click Screen Clipping. Now this way is intelligent enough, you could say, to know to minimize that window right when you click the button. So my window was minimized. Let me take a screenshot of a different section. And it automatically goes there, does the same thing with the insertion of the URL and the time and date. And both times I did that, all I did was click and drag my mouse to make a selection and then release my mouse button. So I didn't have to press any keys or copy and paste or do anything like that. I just took a clip and went right into my OneNote page. And one other note, if you begin to take a screenshot and you decide that you actually don't want to take a screenshot after all, all you have to do is click your mouse and you're taken right back to your OneNote page without taking a screenshot. Hope this tip helped and be sure to check back with 365ninja.com for more tips and tricks on Office 365. Thanks.